Hello there, it's Keris here from Street Feet Dance where we help primary age children to feel less shy, make new friends and get dramatically more confident through street dance. And this video is step one of our how to double your child's confidence in five easy steps video series. So what I want to talk to you about today is all about getting them moving. So studies show that physical activity is great for kids' confidence and that's because it helps them to build their self-esteem, it helps develop their cognitive skills, it helps them to develop muscle strength, it helps them to have a better outlook on life and ultimately it helps them to feel more confident and if you can pick an activity where they're going to be able to burn some energy they're going to start feeling calmer as well as more confident and if you can incorporate some kind of uplifting music into that activity even better because that uplifting music is going to make them feel really really great as well so any kind of after school activity like for example um, going swimming going on a bike ride going for a run around the park, um, enrolling your child in an after school activity like dancing or karate or something like that. And also perhaps an activity that's actually gonna help them improve their posture because when children have great posture, they stand really tall. And when you stand really tall, you look more confident. And when you look more confident, you feel more confident too. So this is my first tip all about helping to get your child moving. The government now are recommending that our children get 60 minutes per day of exercise. And the government have got together with lots of different departments. So public health, they're all, all deciding that activity um, is, re there's a really strong correlation between physical activity and mental health and wellbeing, particularly in children. So these new government guidelines are gonna be that they need to get 60 minutes of physical activity per day. Now if they're not going to get all of that in school, what can we do after school to give them an, an injection of activity? Is there an activity we can roll them in once a week? Is there something we can do at home? Um, is there something where we can get them together with their friends? I'm going to talk about that in the next episode of this five part video series. So as ever, let me know what you think about this. I would love to know and if you'd like a two week free trial at Street Feet Dance, just click the link below. Bye for now.